How's it going guys? Welcome back to another guide for the brand new zombies map Dead of the Night. In this video I'll be showing you how to make a new type of bullet called the Silver Bullets. As far as I'm aware when using it, it basically just doubles the damage coming from bullets or maybe this will be used for an easter egg step later on we don't know easter egg quest was locked when recording this video they obviously are unlocked at the time creating this video so maybe these silver bullets can be used somewhere in the easter egg but this is definitely useful to do before you go and fight the wolf before pack a punch because obviously this doubles bullet damage if you do enjoy this video at any point then a like is appreciated and if you are new to the channel please hit that subscribe yes. button and the little notification bell so you don't miss out on a future video. So this little quest comes in two parts. The first part is making the silver casing and then the second part is collecting the ingredients to make gunpowder and then you combine the two to make silver bullets. Okay, so let's start with the silver casing. There is three pieces of silver dining equipment around the map and all three of them have again three locations but don't worry i've gotten them all written down for you so do not worry about looking for them so going from the left to the right on the progress screen the first piece is in one of the three locations it's either on the corner of the dining room table then in the same room on the opposite side of the wall where the clock is on this little red table and I'm then the third location is going Detail. from inside the library to the oh, middle strange. area, the main hall. It'll be on the ground just right in front of you here. And the second piece, again, I've been testing this map so much today. And this piece only spawns in two locations. There is no other locations that is ever spawned in for me. And for multiple people that I've spoke to about this quest, it's only been in these two locations. And that is either on the table, which is inside the wine cellar, opposite where the stone is. Or a little further ahead on the opposite side of the wall inside this little hole. Then the final piece is a candle holder and that'll be either in the room which is where the Danny perk is which is just opposite where you grab the artifact. It'll be on this left table as you walk in. The second location is inside the snook room as you enter there from the main hall. Just look to the right and it'll be on the floor here. Then the final location is looking towards spawn from the main stairs you go down the right side and just at the end there is a little ledge sticking out under a huge vase then after you've collected all three of them it's time to actually get the parts for the gunpowder to make this entire quest possible so the first part is actually bat poop you know clearly human poop in nine wasn't enough so they've decided to add bat poop inside this map anyway the location for this is all inside the cemetery area it'll either be going up the right side there'll be a tree at the top and it'll be on the floor just behind the tree here if it's not there go to the top of the cemetery area where the perk is turn around and look towards the map follow the right path and you'll just see a little boy statue it'll be in front of this statue and if it's not there, just kind of reverse a little bit. And instead of going past the statue, you keep the path going up. Carry the curve around and it'll be sat on the floor here. The second part that you need is charcoal. And the three locations for these are all in fires. The first one is as you are coming out from the pack a bunch area to the right, it'll be on the floor here. The second location is inside the snooker room just in front of the fire there. And then the final location this can be is the fire inside the master bedroom. The third and final piece for the gunpowder is the sulfur. And all three locations for this is inside the middle greenhouse lab room. So you go through the dining area, down the stairs, and this main middle hut where the telescope is, is where all three locations are. The first one is as you walk through the door on the left side, and then the second one is as you walk through the door on the right side, both on tables. And then the final location is at the top left end of that laboratory area. And it'll be on the table again. And then after you've got all these six parts, you go into the cellar. And there's a craftable table where you will build molten silver. You then take the molten silver to the library with the gunpowder. And then there is a buildable table on the bottom floor of the library. And that is where you will craft the silver bullets. 
And that is it, guys. You have just completed the quest. You've just got upgraded bullets. Like I said, I don't know if these are used for anything else down the line where the Easter egg is actually unlocked. Oh, well, it is unlocked now, but it wasn't at the time. So up to now, it just doubles the damage out of your weapons, which is definitely useful. It's technically a free double tap. So imagine this on top of pack a punch in five times you've got double double taps so there is two ways in this map to increase the damage that you get from your gun which i think is very cool but i honestly think it's going to be used for the easter egg anyway guys that is going to wrap up the video if it did help you out in any way then a like is greatly appreciated and if you are new to the channel don't forget to hit that subscribe button and the little notification bell so you don't miss out on a future guide or a future live stream thank you all so much for watching and i'll see you all in my next video